Hello, 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 everybody. It's I, JMOS from JMOS Gaming, back here with another episode of Halo Reach Legendary. We're on the third mission. I believe it's called Nightfall. We. So, diving back into this campaign now that I've wrapped up Modern Warfare, I want to get that squared away and all done. I believe the format going forward is I'll have two series going. I'll try and stick to a Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. And I might possibly upload like first impressions and reviews on like Tuesday and Thursday, but that's not in concrete yet. Set in stone, you know. Terminology. So, let's get back into this. Yeah, it's nightfall. Okay, good, it is on legendary. This level is always a nightmare. I'm gonna try and be as stealthy as I can, but I don't know how well this will go. Actually, I'm gonna bump the audio just a bit. That might be better. Okay. Got a sniper and a pistol. <clears throat> this is gonna go terribly. I oh, gotta try and remember the controls, I'm too used to Call of Duty. Okay, Q is melee. Okay. Think we're good so far. Nope. Well, I did say I tried stealth, I never said I'd be good at it. Mold in the mindset for Doom Eternal. Just rip and tear. I'm gonna try and save my sniper ammo, because that's very useful, especially for like the heavy elite sections that'll come. Just waste uh, these grunts and jackals and pistol ammo. Okay. Took that out. We can try and actually do the stealthy again. Maybe we can just walk past him? Yeah, neutralize that guy. Just melee him. Melee him. Gotta remember, this is ODS. This isn't ODST. I actually have sound of my guns. Okay, took care of him. Glad they just decided to do that. Look, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna blame them for wanting to help my kill, sh kill streak. Oh yes, active camo is so useful in this map. What's the button for it again? Oh, it's shift, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, shift was sprint before, so it's gonna be active camo now. Bravo to Noble 2, stand by for contact. Is there no subtitles? Why isn't there subtitles? Is it accessibility? Yeah, I have them on. That's weird. It's a pretty big bug if they just. if this is a bug. Maybe there's another thing. There's no way they just have it like this. Uh, localized dialogue, no. Yeah, I want subtitles. What? That's a terrible bug. Or just like gross oversight. Okay, we gotta make our way down here. I could try and snipe him up there, but... Again, I want to preserve ammo. And you don't get the best of angles from there. Okay, let's see, we got... Two, we got five elites in that roof. We got a gold elite there. I think that's gold. I always get the colors wrong. 
So he's the main threat. I, of course, I only had one at, one bullet left in the clip. There was a stealth one in stealth. Okay, that went way better than I thought it'd be. Come on. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Come on, die already. Yeah, Jim, what was your first clue? I can't get over that subtitle thing. How is there no subtitles? Okay. We're damaged, so we'll just do an active camo real quick. How are you not... How are you not dead? I know one of the one in there. Grunt Sender gets really scared by grenades. You can flush him out with, like that. There's a Grunt. There's actually the Grunt I've been looking for, I think. Stop wasting sniper ammo on Grunts. Freaking June. Oh, come on. I'm glad there's just like tons of sniper ammo. Of pit, not sniper ammo. Pistol ammo. Okay, let's not waste active camo. What's in here? Oh, there's a shotgun here. Mm. Same time, I don't want to pick it up. Because I want this pistol. Just so, just for like grunt control. Got you. Whoa, okay. Cause after camo kinda like mutes your game. All I all I saw was the explosion, I didn't even hear anything. There we go, thanks Jin. Ow. Jin, what the Oh I I whiffed that. Whiffed that. There we go. Okay. Checkpoint is going a lot smoother than I thought it'd go. I'm upping the freaking dialogue. Sound. I guess I'm just gonna up the game audio. Why isn't there a dialogue volume? What? Okay. I'd never know- I will never know why some games just don't let you adjust the dialogue volume by itself. It's so standard in a lot of games. And it's sta and it should be standard for a reason. It's extremely useful. Because some games really like to have quiet as hell dialogue and you can barely hear the thing. Especially when there's gameplay going. Come on. So these guys can pretty much take like a whole clip. If I had a if I had all those headshots, some of his shields were charged in between while I was loading. Got him. Hey, okay, this guy's dangerous, I'll actually use Oh, I got him with the Why am I wasting sniper ammo? Come on. The freaking rail guard's like protecting his head. There we go. Got him to pop his head up with a recoil. I 
can't be the only one that thinks, like, from a distance, when you shoot a grunt with, like, a pistol, it kind of looks like they're dabbing. Got you. With a no-scope. Gotta, like, stun on them sometimes, you know? Oh, no. See? Like, from a distance, when you can't actually see the detail. There we go. This is gonna stop. I know I'm doing pretty well right now. All you see is just, like, paint, like, alone. I'm reaping the benefits now. One, the moment this thing goes on empty, oh boy. Things are gonna go, things are gonna turn south, let's just say that. I'm just gonna keep the active camo. And I'm thinking that if the sniper runs out, I might be able to find a shotgun. Then I'll just try and like, get some stealth kills like that. No. Disgusting. No. Oh, got them all. Sweet. Love when a grenade spam all comes together. <coughs> Sorry about that. Let sleeping dogs lie. I like how the ch I like how the missions like broken up into little chapters that have their own names. I'll write this thing. I think I like blocked this thing out of my memory. Let's just try and walk past this thing. Mm -hmm. How are you guys having? That made no sense. I meant to say, how's your guys' day going? Talking to these grunts. Because these grunts are kind of coming in clutch right now. You... This ain't Monster Hunter. Just ignore me for now. Got a checkpoint. That's what we like to see. And we're just gonna move swiftly on from that. Because I'm not trying to waste ammo on that thing. Okay. Ordinarily, I kill these MOA. And let's be honest. I'm still going to kill these MOA. Oh, one of them got away. I feel like I have to resell the mission. I can never tell if there's like a secret back here that I just never found before. It's like the one thing I kind of like from Halo 5. Halo 5's campaign. Is that you can like find like secret weapon, secret named weapons around the map. It encouraged exploration. I actually really enjoyed that part of the game. Granted, it's like the only part of, the, of Halo 5 that I enjoyed, but still. I know it's actually kind of against the norm. I don't mind Halo 5's multiplayer. Like, on its own, it's not a bad game. But, like, trying to claim it as a Halo game is when I say it would be bad. Okay. I know you can zoom this thing in. Well, I hope you guys don't think I'm going to actually save you. Because that ain't going to happen. No, it ain't going to happen. The hell is this elite going? Dude's like sideways moonwalking. Got you. Might be too far away to try this. I still don't want to waste my sniper ammo. Gonna try and get a bit closer, but still like a bit away. Just to try and tease this. I know there's a grunt right over here. If I don't kill him now, I'm never gonna... See? He's dabbing. Like, in a terrible way, but he still kind of is. Probably not. I guarantee you, if you actually look at it, it will look nothing like a dab. But still. The king, like... Shieldless jackals. Who thought this was an idea? Like, who thought this would be good? That's just a bullet sponge if we don't hit a headshot. That would actually be kind of like my main complaint with like Halo campaigns, and the Covenant especially. It's like, everything about a headshot is kind of like pointless, outside of like elites, and sometimes brutes. Because at least you can still like take them down pretty, like well enough if you have an assault rifle. Everything else is just super, like, spongy. 
without a headshot. Granted, I think that has, like, merit. Like, I... I'm all for, like, encouraging skilled gameplay. And I think, like... How headshot vulnerable a lot of mobs are in Halo encourages that. Encourages better aiming, etc. I don't know. Halo's all... Ever since I got into Halo, I've always found that it's kind of my preference for a lot of things in regards to FPS. Higher time to kill, slower gameplay. Not disregarding the like the newer Halos and kind of this one, but not really. Uh, foregoing like class classes. I don't like classes. I like map control and power weapons on the map. And again, that's classic Halos here for you. All right. I see you. No. No. Thanks, Jim. Alright, where are you? I hope I can find more pistol ammo. No, assault rifle's not what I'm looking for. See how big this map is? Why would I want pit? Why would I want? Why would I want assault ammo? Assault rifle ammo. It's getting to the point where I might just go with a shotgun. Oh, pistol ammo! Here we go. Oh, beautiful. Got to remember this like grenades, health pack, and shotgun here. That might come in handy later on. Pick up these grenades when I can. When it comes to worse, I could just use a plasma pistol because they're still not terrible. Hard to use because like the each like plasma bolt is kind of heat seeking in a way. Dang it! I thought I could make that jump for a second. God, remember this is not fall in order. I don't have double jump or Jedi flip as they call it. Okay, here comes the cavalry. Unfortunately, it's enemy cavalry. Dude, look at the skybox here. Like, dang, that's gorgeous. Multiple moons, that giant planet over there. Okay, let's get out of that thing's line of fire. Oh, it would just be like a squadron of like yellow elites. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Well, we had, we had a good run without a death, to be fair. Pretty good checkpoint. Where are they coming from again? There, okay. I always tend to find that these horde mode style sections in Halo campaigns, if you can just camp the spawn a bit, tends to go better. Like this. Let's just get rid of him. I always forget the ammo. Oh yeah, grenade spamming the spawn points as well is extremely useful. You see how many I just took out there? All it took was shield damage. That, like, who cares? That replenishes. Alright, where are the rest of them? I have 20 bullets left for this thing. Okay, jackal down. Hello. Whew, that was close. Crap! Trying to stick around corners here. No. The reason I moved like that is because I want as much cover between me and him as possible. Pick that up. I probably could have held off on that. Until my health was a little bit low, but I don't want to risk it. Got one. There we go. Come on. Fire, 
No, 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 no. Not good, not good, not good. Oh, DMR. I forgot this was here. How do I get this freaking... Hang on. Controls. How do I turn off night vision? Because, no, I don't want this. Configure bindings. There we go. Where are you? Night vision's four for some reason. Okay. Crap. Seriously, who needs night vision in this map? It's like bright as day. Maybe she's like a extremely dim monitor like TV. Which there might be an advantage to night vision. Because some of these elite colors like blend into the background. So if you can get like that green outline going, then you might be well off. Where the hell? Oh, I got freaking grenaded. Didn't even see it. I'm so bad at tracking things with the same rifle. What killed me? Oh, there's an elite behind me? Okay. Got him. Don't ask me how I did that. Let's get the hell out of here, though. Oh, more health pack. More, more health pack. More health. That crap. I forgot how horde mode this mission is at the end. I always have a tendency to block this mission out of my, out of my memory. It's fun, just like, once you do it on Legendary, though, it's like... Oh boy. I never want to do this mission again. Crap. Let's get in here. What's shooting me? Now I wish I had a health pack. Oh, it recharges a bit? Sweet. No. Oh, there's a health pack right there. I'm gonna save that though. These elites could stand still, that'd be appreciated. How much ammo do you have? Only got two rounds left in this thing. Gotta get rid of the concussion rifle. He's hard to kill at close range. Get back here! Got him. There we go. Okay. Now we can forego the snipe rifle, pick up the shotgun, pray to god we get a checkpoint this century. Crap. Okay, kneeling doesn't reveal our position. Dang it, okay. He must have, the computer must have caught me. Got a stealth there. Oh, really? This is the checkpoint you're going to give me? Okay. Remember when I said the death would come later? I think they're here. Okay. Oh, that's what's shooting me from behind. The giant phantom there. Not Danny Phantom, but you know what I'm talking about. It'd be better if... Imagine if Danny Phantom was in this game. Can I kill this guy with my DMR? I want to preserve that sniper ammo as much as I can. If you know, if June could like pick some of these guys off, that'd be appreciated. Yeah, I know. Handle it. Okay. Crap. No! Okay. 
Oh, I was gonna get a pincered attack anyways. Got him, got him, got him. Let's go. Move, 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 move. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Okay. We got out of that and killed the late. This might be our best one yet. Oh, man, we got two jackals. Oh, I see you. Get over here. Really? You're gonna hide behind the one piece of cover there? Really? Really? No, I'm not going out like this. Not happening. Not today, not yesterday, and definitely not tomorrow. We're recharging health. Dance, Jim. Over there. Shout out to Game Glitches. Okay. Okay. Dang it. Really? Every gun has to reload? There we go. That was dangerous. I was playing a dangerous game, man. But it paid off in the end. Sometimes you just have to take risks. Oh, we got more sniper ammo. Let's go. Hmm, maybe it's a giant pathway to the left. George said settlers down the nearby river. There's a few years back. Dry river that might be your best route. Copy. Thanks. You know, the worst part of this mission hasn't even come yet. I know there's like hundreds coming up. Yep. The freaking hydro plant part. Oh boy. You thought the last section was a horde mode. Huh, <laughs> you haven't seen anything yet. I'm just gonna like run as much as I can to get to the next to the hydro plant pot. Okay, clear. Let's move. I've just been running this whole time, June. I got June's like trying to take this like Melika assault, like I'm just like going straight through. Yep. I'll just leave this here. About about to be me with this game if I if I die like ten more times here. I'm gonna die like right near the end, and it's only gonna have a checkpoint like at the beginning of this part. That would be very sad. Very, 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 very sad. I see you. How would the. I hate plasma turrets sometimes. No. No. Boom. Oh, there we go. That's what we're talking about. If you wonder where the game goes like silent sometimes, uh, I think I said I might have said this before, but uh, active camo turns off your sound pretty much, so you can basically play in the silence. In the silence. In the sound of silence. Okay. We might be clear to move up a bit. Maybe not. Every time I forget to reload this thing. 
kind of wish I took the Vockets. I might be able to go back for them, actually. Now that I think about it. Worst comes to worst, I'm just going to try my best to get back there. I am not driving the forklift. I'll be right, fine. We got a checkpoint anyway, so who cares? Oh, I've been driving on. <laughs> oh my gosh, that actually worked. I didn't think the grenade would kill me from there. When you think of it, it wasn't my fault. We're going to do the same strategy again because that almost worked for a second there. Okay. So it turns out they'll just throw a grenade at you. Oh, there's a pad over here. Locked. One, two, three, four. Okay. Nine, eight, seven, six. There's a four digit combo here. I think that might be a secret. I don't know how to get it though. Oh, I hit the reload button. Okay, that worked. Okay, it's quiet. Too quiet. Got you. Oh yeah, this is literally the multiplayer map, but in nighttime. I kind of liked it when they incorporated like campaign missions in the multiplayer, like map little segments of the map. And the last shot, I got the elite. That was worth it. Okay. Ill. Guess I'll have to take this for now until I can find something better. I'll waste ammo on these grunts with it. No plan of doing the whole mission, rest of the mission with this thing. Oh, I think I stuck it. Crap. Oh, I didn't see him until it was too late. Okay. Oh, glad they spawned me here. Let's just keep this on. Going in for the... Oh, he turned around in like half a second. What? I was going for the assassination. Okay, so we know an elite comes up here. Where are you? June, swear to God. Where is this elite? He's somewhere. Just gonna leave that here. You know why he's distracted with June? I'll just mow him down. There we go. And that's how you do that, Pawn Legendary. Thank you for coming to this guy. Defend June! All right, well, let's just take this. And matter of fact, two rockets. What the? Get that out of my face. We'll keep that there in case we need it. Defend you. Get out of here. Shotgun there. Yep, we all know this bit. Alright. Say a lot to my little friend! Can that fan of like screw? Oh my 
gosh, we're actually doing this. Crap, I ran out of ammo. Gotta go back for the... No, 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 no. Not today, Satan. I know you guys have low health. No. That was close. That one was close. But I know the Spectre, Spectre elites have really low health compared to other elites. Look how this game actually thinks we're going to defend June. There we go. We got the... Gr we got the hunters down, that's what we're talking about. As my whole teacher used to say, prior preparation prevents a poor performance. And baby, I'm prepared. There we go. Hope there's not another round of hunters, that suck. There's war. I can't remember this is the end of this is like actually just part of the mission. Because there's stuff on the other side of this wall. I forget when this mission ends. Oh no, I thought that was the end. Oh no. No, no, no. Oh, you're kidding me. June, I swear to God. At least we got a checkpoint there. That's all I'm gonna say. No. No. Oh, I see you. Gotcha. Okay, let's move up. Welcome back. I'm starting to remember this bit. I know I said when you snipe your ammo on grunts, just for that bit, because that shade turn could be a real pain. A real pain in the derriere. I think that's a word. It means butt. No. Oh, your shield broke. Gotcha. Normally when you see a, an elite shield break, you just go for it. Because they have really low HP sometimes. Especially when you hit them in the head. You got a headshot, boom. Like Bob's your uncle. Not happening. Okay. Come on, poke your head out. That thing's about to break. Really? Took way too many rounds to kill that grunt. Gotta be very careful, legendary though. I always tend to find it's easier just to go slower. Slower, pick them off one by one. Or when you can't throw a grenade at a group of them. But when you like see a moment, you have to take it. You just have to. That's like, oh, see, I should have gone close to the rock so his line of fire was let was smaller. Got him. Okay. This time I'm gonna try and preserve my ammo. Gotta be really careful when God's with needless. Those things are annoying. You also want like heat seek. He's Eat away your health. If 
Or it's Spectre, at least. I try and use DMR. Instead of, like, sniper rifle, because they just have... Their shields are so small. And I guess, like, the lore reason behind that would be, like... They funnel most of their... Of the energy they have on their person. Into their stealth. But their stealth can be easily seen. You just have to, like, look for a ripple effect. I don't know why the DMR and the snipers seem to have the same magnification. Okay. We're gonna ignore those whiffs. Got him. Okay. To be fair, this mission is going a lot better than I thought it would. You know, I say that, I'm about to die. There we go. Because June had the snipe rifle, I knew he was aiming at him. Just try and break the shield and June can pop him. I think we can move up. Ooh, crap. Okay, luckily it was just a grunt in there. Crap. I know we're near the end of this mission, so I'm just gonna be a bit more wasteful than normal with the sniper ammo. I forgot how kind of generous they are with this ammo. Really? Why don't you just stood there? There we go. Leads are very dangerous in close combat. But in range, you can really use cover to your advantage because, no, because like every weapon in this game is a projectile. I love it when they just stand there, because they also recoil. Like, if you can hit them, you can really disrupt their rate of fire. Crap, I'm out. I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo. We're gonna move back, see if we can find some ammo. Just let June deal with everything so far. He might be able to pick up a few things for us while we go back looking for ammo. Okay. I'm generally not a big fan of Covenant weapons. Which is why I'm uh, ignoring a lot of them. Also, Bungie was really generous with hidden weapons sometimes. Like, you saw all the shotgun ammo we passed up before. See? Like this kind of stuff right here. Pistol. Which I don't want an assault rifle. I'll take it right now just to have something. Gonna move up, maybe they'll give us more ammo if needed. I forget how close to the end. Because I forget my main thing with Halo campaigns is that I forget a lot how a lot of the missions like end. Outside of like a few. So I can never like plan my ammo like that. I think we're near the end. This mission has gone really smoothly. I normally have a lot more difficulty here. That the end? I think it is. 44 for 45 minutes, not bad. Not bad at all. This is the end, right? Chatbot. Transmitting visual. You've seen this cat? 
confirmed. Receiving Nova 3 and Nova 6 live visual of a Covenant strike force. It's no strike force. It's an invading army. If we're gonna smother this thing, we need to go in hard and fast. Agreed. All recon teams disengage and fall back. Sun will be up in a few hours, and it's going to be a very busy day. So to summarize that mission, June and June and Noble Six went out on a recon mission to try and find Covenant. We found what is essentially an invading strike force. Like in, pretty much an invading army. If you're hearing things, you're hearing like achievements from Xbox. Unexpected. Wings of glory. Tell the story. Okay, look, I won't make that many more Sabaton references. Oh, I'm glad we have freaking subtitles in the cutscene. Yeah, basically, we found, last mission we found an invading Covenant army, and we're gonna go and try to squash it before it, like, overruns reach. That landing zone has been tagged by UNSC command as a priority one target. That charge link is loud and clear. Copy that. Acquiring that is not what that subtitle said. Pilots. Like, at all. Detonating in three, two. This cutscene was always so good. Shout out to the one marine on the back there. Incoming! Might want to hold on to something. Oof. Oof. Six. Can you hear me? Six, you all right? I could yeah, you actually have subtitles now. Double six just talked. Let's go. Think. And that's going to be the end of this part. Thank you all for tuning in. That went a lot better than I thought it go. Than I thought it go. Really like to see that. All right, everyone. Thank you all for tuning in. It's been my pleasure. Hope you all stick around for part four, where we'll tackle the mission tip of the spear. Part time is 15 minutes. I can promise you, we're going to take longer than 15 minutes for that, for this mission. Whew. We got through like the one of the main hurdles for me, and we did so in a swimming fashion. All right, so planning on Monday to have the tip of the spear up. I also plan. I finished Jedi Fallen Order, so I'll get a review up for that. Once I get around to filming, I want to let that let it digest. Then I'll get my thoughts thoughts and review up for that. I'm planning on doing a first impressions for Dragon Quest XI, the definitive edition, Echoes of an Elusive Age. So, yeah, we'll work on that too. And I might, I haven't decided, I might try a further impression for Sekiro, because I'm getting a bit more into the game and I'm really enjoying it. Alright everyone, thank you for tuning in. This is, I've been Jay Moles from Jay Moles Gaming. Goodbye everybody. Bye.